Four years ago today, the Supreme Court made same-sex marriage legal all across the country. Pride Month is celebrated each year in June to recognize the progress of the LGBTQ community and what still needs to be done to achieve full equality. We spoke to prominent figures in the LGBTQ world like Poe star Billy Porter and Sex and the City actor Mario Cantone. We asked what pride means to them. I'm Mario Cantone and I identify as a 25 year old homosexual. Oh, <laughs> That's just the way you make me feel. That's your intro to the world this summer? Yeah, well, all right. I, I'm Mario Cantone and I identify as a gay male. That's so weird to say. I just you identify, identify as, as me. As a gay male? How do you identify? As your husband, darling. I, My name is Jerry Dixon and I'm Mario Cantone's husband. That's just the way you make me feel. I'm Kristen Beck. I'm a transgender American. My name is Billy Porter, and I identify as an African-American queer man. I'm Sharon Bishop Baldwin. I'm a lesbian. And this is my wife, Mary Bishop Baldwin. My name is Gia. I'm 15 years old. I'm transgender. My name is Ryan O'Callaghan, and I identify as a gay man. I have two boys, one of which is gay. We stood with our son at the Oklahoma City Pride Parade, and I became an accidental activist for the LGBTQ plus community. I came out of the womb with the with the biblical cord over my shoulder and a microphone at the end singing Judy Garland. I knew right away. But guys are pretty terrific. Yeah, we like them. Boy crazy. A boy, boy crazy. Boy, boy, boy crazy. crazy. I knew I was gay as soon as I hit puberty. I was so deeply closeted that I was blind to life and what was going on around me. I came out when I was 29 years old, right when my NFL career was coming to an end. You can be amazing. I always knew there was something different about me. I always played with girls' toys, and I didn't really know what I was. I was so nervous to come out, but as soon as I did, I received so much support, and I've been able to be an advocate in my life. I'm just a normal teenager, and being transgender is just one part of me. The process of coming out has been a continual process over the decades of my adult life. I came out to my mother three times. Finally, by the time I was 28, she got it. She wasn't happy with it. I retired from the Navy SEALs in 2011, and I knew I had to start living my own true life and to find my own happiness. And so that's when I started coming out. Being a transgender American, is a very tough life. We're discriminated against, we're killed in the streets. I was frozen in this idea that I had to choose between my child and my faith. I no longer believe that homosexuality is a sin. I believe that it is a gift by God. I now pronounce Mary and Sharon to be lawfully married. We have been thanked by literally thousands of people for filing a lawsuit and for winning marriage equality in Oklahoma, but at the base of that, it was a selfish act. We wanted to get married. Pride Month is a chance for everyone just to have a little more freedom and to just show off a little bit. We're just like you. We're citizens, we're Americans, we're people, we're human beings. I'm proud because I've been able to successfully live my life as an openly gay man. Ten years ago, I never thought that that would be possible. I'm proud because I have nothing to be ashamed of. Uh, I am who I am. I'm proud that we've had a role in helping change the world and improve the lives of LGBTQ Americans. People like us, we've got to stick together. I am proud because I can share my positive story and I feel like celebrating who I really am has made me so much happier with myself. I'm a better person because my child is gay. I came out at 13 years old in 1973 in a suburb of Boston, and I feel so proud about that. I'm proud that we live in a time where there are possibilities because I really did not think that getting legally married to you was a possibility at all. Me neither. As an out, proud, gay, Christian, African-American man. I'm proud of that. We're better together. We're stronger together. Love always wins. The month is about reminding the world that we are here. We've always been here. We will continue to be here. We're never going anywhere. So get used to it. Hi, 
I love that piece. I look yeah. forward to the day where we don't have to remind the world. I love the, the Pride logo because yes. it's so celebratory. It is yeah. indeed. And it's so important. I, I love, love that piece. I love the mother who says she now views homosexuality in her child as a yes. gift by God. I yes. thought that was yes. a really a beautiful piece. Shows how much, it's how a, far yeah, people have come. And it's a modern conversation. We forget that uh, yeah. when Barack Obama yeah. ran for president in 2008, he was not in support yeah. of gay yeah, marriage. Right. It's only yeah. a 2012 turn for him. Yeah. 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 And I have this, I think a special shout out to Mario Crantone's husband, Jerry Dixon. Yeah. Because he clearly has a great sense of humor. I think they get, do a lot of laughter in that. <laughs> They're almost a comedy team, though. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> All right. Done.